Oh my god, it's taking that lighter, but it's so bright and I'm just flashing you over there. Sorry, his makeup background looks so dirty. But it's okay. We'll just use it for today and tomorrow we'll change it in a different one. Ta -da. And I'll let it set. Go into my Majestic, the purple one. Now looks Oasis. I know, I was like fast right here. to my brush purple must done something like that okay so you don't have to be perfect um, all right so crystal clear I may have you if you lock me inside and then just give me this set of a uh, future and some food I'll be okay for like whole day Mika, I'm you gonna give send me some food. I know everyone. I'm s just so goofy because I love food. I don't know is anybody not loving food at all. Some people don't care. Maybe I don't know. But I love food. Now look at that. If you get this, do not worry because. Actually, you can using your crystal clear and blend it the way you want it. I'm doing slow motion right now so I can show you. So if you are like getting your fusioning done for your clients, you know, you can start seeing it. I don't like an idea of this. I'm so enjoying this one. Try to get on the side because my purpose is I'm gonna put my flower on it. So I'll let you see this beautiful fusioning in the veins here. But I need one of this side to do my flowers. So it doesn't matter. I'm gonna move this on the side here a little bit more because I need this edges for my flowers so you can see these super cute flowers. Move this. Yeah, that's it. All right, that's what I want. You want different, you can draw a different look because I want this cute flower to be in there. Let me try that. You see what I mean? So if I move my veins there, and then I get my flowers and maybe some of my butterflies here. So if you can move your veins over here too, it looks cool too. It's however you would like. Or this flowers can be a little bit down, but I like to be in the middle. Okay, I'm so excited. Let's do this together. So here's a look for that, and you can add more veins on it. Um, I don't want to do the veins because I want to do that flowers and the uh, butterflies. Tiny, super cute butterflies. I'm going to do like a little pink, purple. That ladybug looks super cute. Yeah, I got that. I need a little one on the top first. 
because I'm prepared for my flowers because I'm encapsulating that one. I'm fascinating everyone just like to be here with all of you so excited here you go that's your purples and orange butterflies this is the newest collection for fall Ta -da. so many choices this is I like a lot too and there are 3D butterflies. Do you want to see it? Just tell me if you want to see, I'll bring it over. 3D acrylics like this, matching like this. I got myself some collection so I can show you to all of you. Yes, okay, great. There are eight different colors, so you prepare. They're so adorable. Spasso handmade. I can't wait because for the collection of flowers, you absolutely love it. You don't know how many of the clients are asking us for 3D flowers. It saved my life well, and my time so I can save of 30 minutes or before I usually have the client's book and I have to pre-made that. It takes a little bit longer time, but it can be done. But then, you know, if we're busy and it's great to have. I'm gonna bring it over and let do the no wipe top coat or my no wipe top coat. I'm so excited. So by tomorrow when all of the flowers will be dropping, 3D flowers, we're gonna do tutorial to support all of you to see a lot of different designs you can do, incorporate with chamfer foil, fusion ink, uh, crystals. Oh, look at that, this is already cute by itself. But if you add in more, you can. We'll see, no white top on the top of this. And my 3D flowers, my 3D ombre. That's pretty. That's pretty. I want these nails. So it really depends on the clients. You can move it a little bit more in edges or you can do it like this so you aren't catching on the side. So it's like in the frame of the nails. I'm gonna might be at just a little bit of my crystals if you want to. Absolutely no, not necessary if you don't want to. Just my preference, you know me, I want some crystal on it. And it's like, look at this on the side, I'm holding this because I'm gonna strip a little bit. It's a really nice curve with the client's nail so you don't have to worry about it's gonna chipping or catching on the hair. Well, we're gonna go ahead and do a precision glue after we cure this. Cure for 60 seconds. And in the meantime, hold tight. because.